Something we get questions about nearly every day is earwax or cerumen. First, earwax isn't dirty. It actually protects your ears by trapping dust, dirt, and bacteria to help keep your ears healthy. And the cool part is your ears are actually self-cleaning, so most people don't need to do anything to clean them. The skin in your ear canal slowly migrates outward away from your eardrum, kind of like a conveyor belt, and carries wax and debris with it. Also, jaw movements like chewing, talking, and yawning help push wax outward so it can fall out on its own. The problem comes when wax gets stuck or impacted in your ear canal. This is more common in people who wear hearing aids, use earbuds or earplugs frequently, or have just naturally narrow ear canals. One sign that wax may be impacted is if you take a shower or swim and notice the water gets stuck and takes a while to drain out. This can cause muffled hearing or a ringing sound and can be really uncomfortable. So to manage this in the office, we usually use a special spray bottle with warm water and either hydrogen peroxide or saline to flush the wax out. Sometimes we'll use a small tool to scoop or suction it out. And sometimes we'll recommend you using a softening drop like Deep Rocks for a few days first and then come in for removal, which makes it easier. A few other tips, try to avoid Q-tips, which can push the wax in further and risk it getting impacted. Avoid ear candling, which carries a risk of burns and injury. And then avoid those high pressure home irrigation devices that can damage your eardrum. Um, another thing, instead of using earbuds, try switching to the over the ear headphones if possible. The bottom line is earwax is normal and healthy, but if you're having trouble hearing or they feel blocked, don't be embarrassed. Check in with your doctor. We deal with this all the time and we can take care of it quickly, comfortably, and I promise you'll feel so much better.